Let me tell you that basically Zen and Tangle, these two words which are creating the word Zen Tangle, talks about the meditative state of mind through doodling, through doing something by your hand, when you are making the uh, small little strokes and converting them into some kind of patterns and then putting those patterns together uh, to create this beautiful piece of art called Zen Tangle. It has a great impact on child's formative stage. The child has been grown up with a very uh, distorted sometimes uh, state of mind because the child's attention span has come down. Child looks is looking forward to all the time people should pay attention to the child. Child is sometimes behaving in a very, very angry manner. The child is not able to, pay, uh, to, to create focus on what is happening around and the parents are putting a lot of pressure on the child. Zentangle is a deliberate process of slowing down the child, deliberately doing, putting small, small strokes on the piece of paper and getting engrossed into the, the activity which makes no sense to the mind at that moment. Which means, if the child is making some shapes which makes no, sen no sense to the mind, the mind automatically stops creating the inner internal um, process work. So when the mind has been brought to standstill, the inner process of the, uh, the, the uh, growth or the development which takes place in this small little space in the brain takes its own process back. It gets back onto the rail and making this regular habit for children can produce results like the child can become calm. So when the child is practicing Zen Tangle, one, the child is getting into the present moment, the mindfulness what we call about, uh, talk about, and that sets the tone internally to make the, the balancing process which otherwise has been disturbed. And if it is brought in the classroom, when the children are making a lot of noise for example, and the teacher says, come on let's have five minutes of Zen Tangle, and the children bring out their notebooks or diaries or whatever they are doing and the teacher initiates that and you will find that children become absolutely quiet. People have reported from USA where it is already being used that the most noisiest class or the most disruptive children have become very quiet and that was an aha feeling the teachers got. Mm -hmm.